Roadstone manufactures 7.5 and 13 Newton thermal light block. This case study will show cost savings using Roadstone thermal light block with Roadstone's Y value calculation service to reduce the Y value at key junctions within a typical A2 NZ compliant semi detached house that meets the carbon performance coefficient and energy performance coefficient outlined within Part L 2019 of the building regulations. We will show six different construction details using three different Y value scenarios. The options for each detail are standard concrete block construction, construction using roadstone thermal light block, construction using roadstone thermal light block and roadstone's Y value calculation. Detail 1 is the junction of the ground floor and external wall. Option A shows a standard concrete block construction having a thermal bridge with a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone thermal light block being used, two 100mm thermal light blocks on the flat, with one 140mm thermal light block along with two 100mm thermal light soap bars. This allows the builder to use a Y value of 0.08, which allows the builder to remove the internal dry lining from the walls to accrue cost saving while maintaining the A2 house. In option C, the builder avails of Roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0.048, thereby allowing a reduction in thickness of insulation in both the floor and walls while still maintaining the A2 BEO rating. Detail 2 is the junction of the ground floor and internal wall. Option A shows a standard concrete block construction having a thermal bridge giving a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone thermal light block being used, two 100mm thermal light soap bars. This allows the builder to take a Y value of 0.08. In option C, the builder avails of roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0.048, thereby allowing a reduction in the thickness of insulation in the floor while still maintaining the A2 BEO rating. Detail 3 is the junction of the ground floor and party wall. Option A shows a standard concrete block construction having a thermal bridge giving a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone thermal light block being used, 100mm thermal light blocks laid on the flat. This allows the builder to take a Y value of 0.08. In option C, the builder avails of roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0.048, thereby allowing a reduction in the thickness of insulation in the floor while still maintaining the A2 BEO rating. Detail 4 is the jam detail. Option A shows a standard concrete L-block construction giving a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone thermal light block which provides a robust detail for securing the window or door. This allows the builder to take a Y value of 0.08 which allows the removal of the internal dry lining from the walls to accrue cost saving while maintaining the A2 house. In option C, the builder avails of roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0.048, thereby allowing a reduction in the thickness of insulation in the wall while still maintaining his A2 BEO rating. Detail 5 is the junction of the first floor ceiling and gable wall. Option A shows a standard concrete block construction having a thermal bridge giving a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone 100mm thermal light block. This allows the builder to take a Y value of 0.08 which allows the removal of the internal dry lining from the walls to accrue cost saving while maintaining the A2 house. In option C, the builder avails of Roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0.048, thereby allowing a reduction in the thickness of insulation in the wall while still maintaining the A2 BEO rating. Finally, detail 6 is the eaves detail. Option A shows a standard concrete block construction having a thermal bridge giving a Y value of 0.15. Option B shows roadstone thermal light block being used with the part L detail. This allows the builder to take a Y value of 0.08, which allows the removal of the internal dry lining from the walls and remove the solar panels from the roof and reduce the cost of the front door, allowing the builder to accrue cost saving while maintaining the A2 house. In option C, the builder avails of Roadstone's Y value calculation service to get a Y value of 0 
thereby allowing the reductions achieved in option B, plus reducing the thickness of insulation in the wall and attic while still maintaining his A2 BEO rating. The original cost to build this A2 rated semi-detached house was €144,657. Option B provides cost savings of €2,701 requiring the use of Roadstone Thermal Light Block along with Roadstone ACDs which are free to download from the Roadstone website. By fully availing of Roadstone Thermal Light Block along with Roadstone's Y-Value Calculation Service, the same A2 rated house can now be built for €141,310 which produces a build cost saving of €3,347 while still producing an A2 rated house. Roadstone Limited, driving cost saving through innovation.